Hey there, Lauren. Let's take a look at those alligator photos. Is this the room? What is that guy's problem? Mm. <laughs> we'll come back to that. Remember, not about the person, it's about the alligator. Mm, and I know you shot a ton of photos, so maybe you did it, but um, I think maybe having the, the claw in focus and this going on in the background, I don't think this needs to be, you know, super sharp. We would still be able to tell that the person's doing something. Mm, it might do a better job telling the story. Maybe. See your settings are. Well, you got a pretty low ISO, so you can um, open this up, you know, in Photoshop if you needed to, without it looking bad. There's some. I know there's stuff laying everywhere, but there's something about that Coke. Right, yeah, these are the best I've seen so far. Like that. I like the natural framing, but it, it just has to be something darker. This is just too bright and distracting. I know you obviously we can't move anything, so you just have to work with what you have, but uh, that's why that doesn't work. Oh, I see what you're talking about. All right. Um, and another thing to remember is like the minute process, 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 -y processes. I don't know. Uh, but like the details like this, that they have to, you know, after they cover up the seams, they have to go back and, and draw in the scales. Uh, that, yeah, that's all product, part of the process, but think, think bigger picture because, again, you're not just doing a story on taxidermists. You're doing it on the, uh, well, I think, we think, we're not sure, and it's up to you. I don't want to drive, direct your story, your essay for you, but at the alligator industry, you know, the overall. So, um, where was I going with that? Um, like when this kind of stuff is going on, this goes back to the other thing, like showing the claw in focus. Um, don't don't get hung up on on these this detail stuff and and take you know a million photos of of the guy doing this um like shoot wider walk around you know get up on tables or chairs if they're sturdy and you know shoot from different angles like the entire thing that's going on there's definitely definitely room for details um i don't know if I'm, i th i think you know exactly what i'm talking about Now, with that being said, like when you're, you know, finishing this uh, piece, um, there might be, you know, one photo from a different situation that kind of, um, that kind of goes with, you know, maybe this photo or is somehow, um, 
So, I just keep contradicting myself. You do what your heart tells you to do. Whatever he is uh, sanding away, uh, that fine particle mist that you're inhaling is, is definitely poisonous. Um, I'm just kidding. Why are these so dark? Mm. All right. The only thing you could have done is gone up on your ISO. It's not. Yeah, see, uh, you might have missed it, or maybe not. We'll see. But like this thing, like laying there on the table, is like the most interesting thing going on in the room. Um, so, hopefully, you have some more photos of it. And there's that Coke and the water. If the Coke had a funny name. Uh, this might, I don't know. No, keep going. Like, what if the Coke's name was Allie? A L L I, like the girl? Instead of Margaret or whatever it is. That would be funny. I don't even know what that Murphy <laughs> it could be an alligator name alright this is interesting Murphy the alligator see here you're starting to walk around I'm going pretty slow, I'm sorry. It's gonna take all day. I'm just mesmerized. I would not stand on that chair. But maybe there's a step stool around or something. Oh, this is interesting. There we go. Oh. Tag that. Uh, like, I want to see his hand. Like, isn't the claw like coming out of his hand? It's like he's holding hands with the thing. Maybe. Might have been something. Maybe not. Maybe you saw it. We'll see. Maybe. 
might be covering it up. <laughs> stand on one of these buckets there's no telling what kind of dangerous chemical is in there uh, he's blowing off the dust and he must uh, did he just open up the garage door I would think I would keep that open maybe he did oh so, so close oh Oh, oh. Mm. Uh, it's not going to cut it. Oh. That's so very close. Uh, he moved too fast. You didn't move fast enough. It happens. I mean, it probably would have been a portfolio photo, but... Um. If they were easy to get, that it wouldn't be any fun. Um, I think, come on, come on back down to the head. I think the head needs another wiping off. All right, this is something. Mm, that, that's very nice. Um, oh, come on. <laughs> uh oh, we're getting close here. All right, I'm going to take my time. I'm rooting for you. something oh uh, why are we just seeing the very very top <clears throat> uh, I mean this all this is still a possible photo but this needs to be uh, wider like we want to see the whole jaw oh I see it's got a board in its mouth okay so you have to do it um, did I not tag that one? Yeah. Oops. What my problem is, I did two of them. Okay. Hmm. That's interesting. Which one? That one. Give his thumb some room. Uh, that one. Ooh, maybe that one. I just keep getting better. This alligator is. Well, I guess I don't know. Why do they have to do that? Huh. If the journalism thing doesn't work out, you can go into the alligator taxidermy business. 
in other ways. Is a tattoo on his arm? <laughs> uh, I'm just thinking how <laughs> flammable that thing is. It'd probably blow up. Wow. What in the hell? <laughs> oh gosh. Alright, so these could be brightened up. It makes me think of something. It seems like there's something like this in the Natural History Museum at UF. Uh, you know, the really cool museum next to the really boring art museum. Um, and it seems like they might they might have something like this. And I wonder, like, how often do they cl clean it? Is there someone that like 
you know, in the morning, gets in there and dusts it off, because that would be a cool shot. Maybe every, maybe they do it every a couple times a year. I don't know. Might be worth a phone call or an email. What's going on here? Yeah, that's what my dad had. Well, at least they all look happy. This is something that if you have a tripod, uh, do a longer exposure and a greater uh, depth of field. I don't know if these are the ones that you were sneaking or if, if they were cool with you photographing these. Um, This is nice, but your focus needs to be somewhere in the middle here. <laughs> you put that in like a kid's bedroom. <laughs> Ruin him for life. Him or her. That's just... Again, I feel it needs to be a little wider, shot a little wider. Like all the weird stuff or, or interesting stuff. Yeah. Uh, you can uh, get rid of the horizontals. Uh, uh, horizontal. a little uh, armadillo you really have to keep the purses in there I want the armadillo in there though I realize the light there we go the light keeps changing these horrible fluorescent bulbs Wow, those are nice. Caleb. Mm. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I 
should see if you can come back on eyeball day. Where they put the eyeballs in. Seems like a kind of small alligator to be getting mounted. But Again, don't make this a uh, process piece. Uh, make it an artistic exploration. An investigation into the alligator industry. I would want my alligator to have blue eyes. What? He's got a finger tattoo. Yeah, I'd like to get a tattoo. Sure, where would you like it? On my finger. Okay. We're gonna get the head this time, let's see. The jaw, the lower jaw. Hmm. It's kind of nice. Hmm. It didn't quite cooperate. Oh no. Did you move? Most people won't be able to tell what this is. We need to be lower so you can see the teeth. Oh, all right, let's see here. Yep. Yeah, that was it. Nice. Sort of epoxy mixture, glue. What is this? What is this mysterious substance? That's what's in the uh oh. What in the heck?
Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Back scratcher. Did warn me. Looks like that one's shooting the bird. Okay, here we go. We need sharp focus, which you know the light's no good and blah blah blah. That's what we're looking for. That's what we're talking about. Bam. Are you serious? That's the photo. Very nice job. Very nice. Not too far away. A bag, close up of the bag, just the inside of the bag. Where's that photo? successful glad you tried it do that alligator is interesting the big one shot in the bag without moving it which of course you cannot do so that's why we don't see that further <laughs> uh, creepy. Creepy but good. Which one? 
Fifty dollars. That's real. Oh, don't forget this time of year. I know there's probably not a lot of uh, fairs and festivals going on, but uh, in, in, in this area of Florida and southern Georgia, you know, they do have a lot of, like every weekend in, you know, a different town, there's a fair. And um, there, there's always usually a booth selling fried gator tail. Um, so that might be something... This is going to explode with all that varnish. Hmm. Is that it? All right. I will show you what I tag just for your reference like we do. So you can pause it or whatever if you need to, and then I'll scroll down. So obviously there's several that could be narrowed down, but um, I would just keep that in the loose edit for now and keep going. You're doing a fantastic job. Uh, text me or call me if you have any questions. Alrighty, bye.